Well, hello, my friend. This is Tony Stewart. And um, today we're going to continue talking about the coronavirus from a different perspective. And uh, I want to talk to you a little bit about the three types of people. Now, you might say, well, the three types of people, was that referred to uh, in terms of symptoms or, or just what they're doing and so forth and so on? Well, kind of. The three types of people, and this really applies to all of life, not just during this um, pandemic, are number one, people who make things happen. People who make things happen. Number two is people who watch things happen. And then number three are people who, like Ricky Ricardo from I Love Lucy would say, what happened? <laughs> three types of people. Now, you might say, what does that have to do with this? Well, you can choose to, which of those categories you want to be in. And what's even more, what category you want to be on in in the future. You see, a lot of folks are sitting there and they're walking around like victims and they're saying, what happened? You know, now I've gotten emails that uh, theaters have closed, restaurants are closing. I mean, all these things are going on and they're walking around like victims. Well, let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a make things happen mindset type of question. If you would have known six months ago that we would be sitting here, what would you be doing differently? What would you have done differently six months ago? Knowing that today we'd be in a situation where, you know, it's a national emergency, all these different things are going on. Hey, Sandy, all these things are happening. What would you be doing differently if you knew six months ago? If you're the kind of person that makes things happen, you're saying this happened once, it could even happen again. Strike a line now and decide that you're going to do something different. So prepare yourself not only for the remainder of whatever goes on here, but what happens next. You know, if would you have done something different in terms of your investments? Maybe. Or maybe you're looking at this and saying this is an opportunity to buy because the whole market's on sale. The key is be a person that makes things happen. Now, you can sit back and watch things happen. And we have a, um, a news media force that's in pure action is saying, hey, listen, we will give you as much, uh, you know, CNN stands for constant negative news. I mean, they'll give you as much stuff as you want to. Like I told you yesterday, there's radio stations that have 24-7 coronavirus stuff because they want to make sure that you're staying abreast of all the things that are going on. So you can be a person that watches things happen, but I want to encourage you, be a person that makes things happen. And the other thing you can do to make things happen is use this as a time for growth. So as I've told you before, and I'm telling you again, if you inbox me, I'll send you the top five books you should be reading right now. Books that will inspire you, books that will help you go to a different level, books that will take your mind off of negativity and make this something that's positive. So inbox me, I'll get those top five books to you. Be blessed, be safe, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye now.